the whole time? Didn't see you there. That was the most awkward intro I've ever filmed. I had to like sit this up and then walk out and then come back in. And it was really weird. But that's besides the point. Today's video is gonna be super fun because I get to try a lot of pumpkin spice related drinks. And I'm really excited for that because I love pumpkin spice and it's fall time and that's kind of like a thing in the fall season. So this video is me trying different pumpkin flavored slash pumpkin spice lattes at different cafes near me where I live. I live in Texas. I won't like tell you exactly where I live, but I do live in Texas. And first, I think I'm going to Starbucks today. And that's like the most classic, basic fall place to go for a drink the pumpkin spice latte and I'm super excited for it but I'm basically just gonna go to different places and I'll tell you guys how much I like them like I'll rate the different drinks and stuff so I think this is gonna be a really fun video and I haven't seen anyone else do this kind of video so I feel really good that this is a little more of a creative video actually my mom came up with it but so she's the creative one it's not actually me but I'm working on the creativity guys it's just like it's just not everyone's born with the creative genes but I'm going to drive my mom and I to Starbucks and we're going to get the drink so that's that's the tea or should I say the pumpkin spice grandma okay see you <laughs> pumpkin spice latte and I feel like this was kind of obvious like we all knew this was coming but I give it a 10 out of 10 it's really good my mom accidentally got me the one with like caffeine in it because it has I think it has a little bit of espresso or coffee in it and it was really good but now I'm gonna be like super energetic and like really weird and crazy because I never I don't drink coffee I don't ingest a lot of caffeine but back to the drink it's so good I really like it I give it a 10 out of 10 the challenge really is gonna come when we go to other places other than Starbucks because I think we all know that Starbucks is really good at making their pumpkin spice lattes but yeah I would highly recommend you can get this if you don't like um, the espresso or coffee in it you can order it and they will take it out which also tastes really good so yeah that is my rating for this drink and now I will see you when I'm trying out the next location oh that's awkward hey guys so it's day two not two consecutive days in a row it's actually been like a week since I filmed the pumpkin spice latte I'm gonna turn down my air real quick because I feel like it's close to the camera. Okay, I think that's better. But now we are at this little cafe called Sophia's Kitchen and they actually have a pumpkin spice chai latte and I love chai so I'm really excited for this. I've never had a pumpkin spice chai drink before so I'm really excited to try this and yeah so i'm gonna go in anyways we're going to go into sophia's kitchen and try this dope drink sorry kids don't use dope these days anymore so i'm going to have to take that out of my vocabulary anyways let's just get going bye okay <laughs>
I'm at this really pretty scenic area with like a little waterfall. I don't know if you can see it, but super pretty and I tried out the drink and oh my goodness, it's so good. I, I love chai, like that's my favorite flavored drink, but this is better. It's pumpkin spice chai iced latte and it's so good. And then I had a pumpkin spice um, donut with it, which was amazing. Like, I feel like I'm just saying everything was so good, but it was better than I expected. Like, I really didn't think it was gonna be that good. So, if you live near the Castle Hills and you live near Sophia's Kitchen, then you should totally try this out because it was really good. But sadly, this isn't like a chain store. Like, it's not at multiple places. It's just right here kind of close to where I live but it's really good and if you have anywhere that sells like pumpkin spice chai lattes I would highly recommend and I also give this a 10 out of 10 actually I give it a, an 11 out of 10 because I got a donut too which is a bonus and donuts make everything better so that is my rating and I will see you guys at the next location bye Hi guys, so it's now day three of this video and I'm at Parks Coffee. This place is really cool because it makes the coffee, like it actually grinds the coffee beans and does all of those itty bitty little detail things, but they also sell drinks too. And I'm gonna be getting the maple pumpkin spice drink. I don't know if it's a latte or what it is quite yet, but that's what I'm gonna be getting. I'm also gonna be taking some pictures here because it's super cute and I want my Instagram to be popping and they're gonna be super fall themed so if you want some fall vibes you should go check out my Instagram because I'll probably have a few of them up but my mom is in there waiting and she's probably wondering what on earth I'm doing and why this intro is taking so long so I'll see you guys in there when I'm trying out the drink Okay guys, so you just saw me try out the drink and now it's time for me to rate it for you guys. So that drink had more coffee in it, I think, than the pumpkin spice latte at Starbucks that had coffee because I really liked that one. This one, since it had a little more coffee, I didn't personally prefer because I'm not a coffee drinker, I don't really like coffee. So because of that reason, I would rate it a seven, six instead of like a 10. But the part that didn't taste like coffee was really good and the whipped cream is amazing and it's really pretty. It's super aesthetic, great for photos, highly recommend for that. My mom did try it and she loves coffee and she said she would give it a 10 out of 10 and that it was really good. She said she would recommend recommend it to any of you guys who like coffee and enjoy the taste of bitterness. But yeah, that is my rating for this. If I liked coffee, I would definitely give it a 10 out of 10, I think. But yeah, that's all for this drink and now on to the next one. 
Hi guys, so today is the last day of this video. It's day four and I'm going to a little place in the mall like the little kiosk that you see. It's called Pacino Gelato and Cafe and they actually have like real stores but this one just happens to be in the mall and they have pumpkin flavored gelato and you can take that gelato and like make it into a shake or add espresso to it so I think I might make it into a shake but I'm not totally sure what I'm going to do with it but I will let you know at the end when I'm rating the drink and let you know exactly what I got. I just wanted to tell you about my t-shirt that I have because I'm actually so obsessed with it and I think it's so cute. It is a little Jeep and it says God is good. I don't know if you can see it but I will leave the link to all of the shirts from this company I think it's called Glow Fashion and they have so many super cute like Visco inspired t-shirts and they have some crew necks as well and she, the girl her name is Glow glow for short she just came out with some new designs so you should totally check them out I'll put the link in the description like I said and you can use my code lyric 10 for a discount I love their shirts and they're so aesthetic so definitely check them out and yeah let's go try out this drink <music> Okay 
guys so i'm back from the mall and if you saw some random clips of my brother and i being obnoxious we were kind of like just going around the mall having a good time it was actually really fun so that's what happened there but now i'm going to rate the drink for you guys so it was really good that one had coffee in it like i said earlier but i really liked it and the more i drank it the more i liked it i think i would prefer it even more if it was iced because i'm just like an iced drink kind of girl like i would have iced drinks in winter but i would give that one an 8 out of 10. it was really good and the froth on top was super nice and we sampled pumpkin ice cream because they somehow they melted and put it into the drink so we wanted to taste that before we got the drink and the pumpkin ice cream really good guys so like if you ever go to if you ever go to Pachico, then definitely try the ice cream if you would like. So I forgot to mention that I have a giveaway going on right now on my Instagram. So go check out my post. I will put a picture up of the post that I'm talking about right here so you know which one to look for. But I have a giveaway going on for a case free case for you guys from case app this is one of their designs and i chose the tough case they have skins and they have actual cases and i really love them because they are protective and they feel so nice to hold like they're not super thick but they are protective and this is one of their designs that i got i chose to get and then you can also design your own. So I'm going to show you the one I designed real quick. This is the one I designed. It's like a Visco inspired one. And it has like a little Polaroid picture of me. And then a bunch of Visco things which I love. So you can design your own. Or you can use one of their patterns. And they have like some super cool fall patterns and stuff. So that's perfect for this season. So go enter in my giveaway on Instagram. I think by the time I'm uploading this. It will be ending in a week. And I will be announcing the winner on my insta story so just go enter that and yeah i hope you win good luck that is all for this video i had a lot of fun filming this and i want to do more videos like this where i like try things out and that kind of stuff and drive around to different places that's just so much fun i really enjoyed filming this video and i hope you guys liked it i hope you have been liking my recent content a little more i'm trying to like up my game a bit but yeah, I really hope you all enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Also, don't forget to check out the link in the description for awesome shirts like these. Okay, love you. Bye. bye, bye, bye.